This is N7JFP. Today we're going to be starting up some programs so we can receive a FT8. First thing we need to do is check to make sure that our audio microphone and speakers from the audio codex is working, or at least there. And we want to check down here where our ports are. And we have a couple of ports. One's COM5. Port settings, 38400. And power management, make sure this is clicked off so it doesn't get turned off. And we got uh, COM6. It's setting at 19200. COM6 will be the CIV cable and COM5 is the USB cable. And we make sure our clock is running. Dimension 4. So our computers will be synced up. Okay, now we need to start the Ham Radio Deluxe. Set for COM5 38400. Auto start with the logbook. So we have rig control up and running. And in the logbook, we need to go to configure QSO forwarding. We're going to be receiving UDP packets from uh, WSJTX for logging into my logbook. So that is checked. And then we can minimize that. So we're going to start uh, instance number one. And to do that, we add on the little rig name and call it something. And this one's called JT Alert. So we have JT Alert version of the WSJTX. And we can check the settings, the name, radio. This one talks to Ham Radio Deluxe right here. Ham Radio Deluxe. And then for audio, we make sure we're getting the audio codex in, microphone and speakers, and reporting. 2237 is how it talks to JT Alert. And we don't have logging enabled. So we can minimize this. And we don't need the graph at all. So next we want to start JT Alert. Here we are few things we could check. Under logging, we're going to make sure under Ham Radio Deluxe that we don't have it enabled. And under applications, We'll make sure we're not checking resend any packets out. So once that's done, six, we jump over here. We're going to start the second instance of WSJT, which is this guy. You see here, this guy's called Grid. We double click on that. CQ. So now we have 
WSJT-X number two, which is this guy here. It's feeding through a CIV cable, COM6. And we're going to make sure that it's 2500 is what's feeding grid tracker. So we go into File, Settings, Radio is the COM6 port, and then Reporting, Prompt Me to Log. 2500 is grid tracker, and then we enable the logging contacts go over CQ. to logbook here on 2333. That's this port. And audio, make sure it's codex, microphone, speaker. So that's about it. So I have it on a dummy load and it's still receiving signals. So next we're going to start the grid tracker. We'll drag it over here so we can see it. We want to make sure, by going to the settings here, that we have 2500. We will be receiving UDP packets from WSJTX grid. Missouri. And this one is not enabled. And logging, we leave it all unchecked. Up here we should be getting receive and decode Band auto digital mixed live. And get rid of this by pressing F12. Then you can zoom in. Missouri. Then we're going to drag this off the screen over here. And we can test it. See if it's where we're on a dummy load, so we can do a... We have <clears throat> the wide graph up here. Missouri. Control, left mouse moves both of them. Transmit and receive markers. So we'll put that over here. And we press tune. And we get five watts out. Illinois. And you see 5 watts here and 5 watts there. And this is our transmit signal. And you see there's no ALC marks. And click that off. So we're ready to start receiving information. Well, let's start. We'll see if there's anything out there. CQ, Illinois, Texas, Louisiana, Indiana. Here's the wide graph. Illinois, Idaho, Kentucky, Oregon. CQ, Texas, Louisiana. And here we can pull up this. Oregon, Missouri, CQ, Hawaii. We can toggle the balloons to the grids. 
Illinois, Texas, CQ, Tennessee, You get this Kentucky, little indicator saying Idaho. this guy is transmitting to this guy. Oregon, Missouri, CQ, Hawaii, Illinois, Alabama. Texas, Tennessee, CQ. Oregon, Illinois, Hawaii. CQ Louisiana. Louisiana This one here you can see it's got going both CQ. directions Hawaii Illinois, Texas, CQ, Kentucky, Hawaii, Illinois. Okay, let's try Hawaii. something here. Michigan, New Mexico, Illinois, Indiana. Wisconsin, CQ, Missouri, Hawaii, Texas. There's Arizona. Let's try Arizona. Washington to Arizona. Illinois, oh, CQ, found Wisconsin, us. Missouri, Texas. He's talking to us, Arizona to Washington. CQ, Illinois, Hawaii, Missouri, Texas. Our report came up. And the name should be filled in from this guy here. So we say OK. We're sending the 73 out. CQ, Missouri, Texas, Hawaii, Illinois, That's all there is to it. It looks too easy, doesn't it? And the map is really nice. Throw in the voice. What else could you ask for? CQ, Michigan, Indiana, Tennessee. Anyway, that's about it. I have to go log this to LOTW and make sure it gets up to EQSL. 73. N7 JFP.